안녕하세요 엘리스 펑크예요 제가 런던에 왔는데 어떤 걸 준비해볼까 하다가 아무래도 패션 스타일리스트니까 여러분들이 패션에 관심이 많으신 분들이 많이 구독을 해주시더라고요 그래서 런던에 있는 유명한 패션 학생들을 만나보고 런던 패션에 대해서 얘기를 나눠보려고 해요 그러면은 만나볼까요? 여기 어떤 과를 지금 다니고 계세요? 저는 지금 남성복 전공하고 있어요. 아, 그러면 어떻게 여기 패션으로 여기 유학 올 생각을 하셨어요? 원래 처음에 한국에서 그냥 학원 다니면서 음. 그냥 미술에 관해서 공부를 하다가 그리고 제가 관심 가는 분야가 뭔지 그냥 계속 뭐 그림도 그리고 음. 뭐 작업도 여러 가지 하다가 고민한 결과에 그냥 패션을 정했고 그리고 뭐 나라도 맨 처음에 고민했었죠. 음. 뭐 뉴욕 갈 건지. 런던 갈 건지 근데 그냥 좋아하는 디자이너들이나 그런 게더 런던이 맞는 것 같아서 여기를 선택하게 됐어요 근데 LCF를 선택한 이유가 뭐예요? LCF를 선택한 이유가 특별히 있는 건 없었고 맨 처음에는 여기 학교가 워낙 여러 개 있고 그냥 저도 지원을 여러 개 하다가 특히 제가 하고 싶은 게 남성복이었어서 남성복이 어느 쪽이 제일 좋은지 알아보던 결과 뭐 세, 세인 마틴에도 남성복이 있고 LCF에도 있는데 저는 LCF가 좀더 맞다고 생각이 들어서 이쪽에 지원하게 됐고 음. 그래서 들어왔습니다 주로 디자인하고 하면서 영감은 어디서 많이 받으세요? 그냥 여기서 느끼는 감정들이나 그냥 그리고 길거리에서 사진 찍는 걸 좋아해서 길거리에 사람들이 입는 스타일이나 그런 것들 많이 찍어놓고 그리고 빈티지를 보거나 제 아이디어와 이런 것들을 섞어서 만드는 편이에요 그럼 학교를 졸업하고 나면 은 어떤 장래 희망? 뭐 꿈이 뭔지? 꿈은 물론 개인 브랜드를 하고 싶은데 일단은 졸업하고 다른 회사에서 인턴도 하고 뭐 일도 해보면서 확실하게 내가 원하는 게 뭔지 알고 나서 브랜드를 하는 게 그걸 준비하시는 분들이 많은데 뭐 주의할 점이나 뭐 기... 전해주고 싶은 말씀 있어요? 혹시 한국 분이시니까 오히려 더잘 아실 것 같아서 맨 처음에 사실 저도 되게 두려운 게 많았고 고민되는 것들이 많은데 저도 영어를 아예 거의 못하는 상태에서 왔고 그런 것들은 사실 와서 부딪히니까 문제가 안 되더라고요 물론 여기서 요구하는 수치에 그런 영어 점수가 있지만 그런 것만 확실히 하고 준비할 작업들만 확실히 하고 그 자기의 꿈이 확실하다면 여기서는 한국에서 느낄 수 없는 엄청 많은 것들을 느낄 수 있는 거는 네, 장담할 수 있는 부분인 어. 것 같아요. 그럼 2년 동안 LCF를 다니면서 이 학교에서 특별히 배, 얻은 거나 아니면 이 학교 장점이라고 생각하는 게 따로 있으신가요? 저는 여기서의 장점을 많이 느낀 게 그냥 과 이름도 맨즈웨어 테크닉 관련해서고 그냥 좀더 여기서 준비하는 과정들이 이제 졸업했을 때 실무에 좀더 가깝게 딱 준비된 상태로 나갈 수 있게 해주는 빨리빨리 이런 모든 프로세스를 끝내고 결과물을 만들고 이런 과정들을 반복하면서 그런 부분들을 많이 도와주는 것 같아요. Hello, my name is Arthur. I'm from Latvia. I study um, women's wear first year at Swan of Old Fashion. And yeah. Because like it's one of the best universities in the whole world and you can like express yourself and experiment with passion more like yeah. Um my favorite brands art school. Do you know art school? They're like a new fashion brand, they make like queer. Like they it's not more about fashion, they like brand. They use like queer people as muses. You should check them out. They're like so amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, I also love John Galliano, McQueen. Yeah, a lot of them. I love them all. Not really, because I like to wear their like um, outfits and stuff, but I want to create like glam, oh. like. Glitter, shiny yeah, yeah. things, everything. Yeah, I like woman. Is <laughs> CL from Korea? CL. Yeah, I love her. She's amazing. Yeah, I think that's the yeah, the only 
person I know and her group two to one. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I love them. They're amazing. Like Korean fashion is like crazy. I love it. Uh -huh. It's like everything is everywhere and like everything's too much, but it's amazing. No, no, no. I really want to go, but like I'm a student and I'm poor, so yeah. Studying here? Yeah. I don't even know, yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think like here in London we call it fashion, they're, they're more like technical, like about patterns and stuff like that. They're not like making crazy shit like throwing fabrics on mannequins and call it fashion, like in other London unis, yeah. Oh my god, I love the boots. <laughs> very Balenciaga, very Balenciaga, I love them. Dior. Oh, they're Dior. Oh, fuck <laughs> off. Oh, they're amazing, yeah. They're very pretty. Thank you. You look so cool. Thank Gorgeous. you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, okay my name's Caprice Brown. I study pattern cutting at UAL. Uh, so the inspiration is more like in my life, um, I guess, what's going on and just how I can help the people who inspire me. So right now, for one of my concepts, I'm looking at grime culture, so looking at the underground culture in terms of where people like live and how they get inspired by their music and how I'm in like kind of incorporating that into like my project is that I'm looking at the sound waves, how I can create um, fabric manipulations to look like sound waves, so that's what I'm currently, um, yeah, I'm working on. Um, well, because I wouldn't know because I haven't travelled that much, but just from kind of this always being my dream, different individuals have multicultural, I would say, um, the people were kind of going to UAL is something that I've like it's a place where I've always wanted to kind of go and explore. I love the way people like for, like, for example, just growing up in London, I feel like I've always had to kind of suppress my style. So just seeing how people kind of really express themselves and really show their like full identity and how they wore their clothes with like color and just, you know, really being their true selves really like excited me I was like yes I can go to like a uni where I can fully be myself I don't have to suppress anything I can be who I am and get to meet different people from all over and just really just get to know them and who they are and where they're from so I feel like in terms of this uni it's really good for that so yeah Okay, so um, I always wanted to go to like a fashion school. Like I always was passionate about like designing. I started off doing like illustrations and sketching, you know, being in my bedroom and kind of pretending that I had my own shop and cutting out clothes from magazines. It was always a dream of mine to go to a fashion uni. I did want to go to CSM, Central, you know, St. Martin's, but um, alongside that, I also wanted to go to UAL. So when I found out I got in, I was like, I couldn't believe it. So I was really excited but yeah this is I knew its reputation so I, I done my research and things like that but in terms of like the course I wanted to do fashion design women's wear but the you know the course was full so I kind of done my research um, I looked into like pattern cutting I looked at the course and what it was going to offer so I knew I was able I knew I was still going to be able to you know design make illustrations you know do have a sketchbook and a portfolio so that's why I chose pattern cutting so like as soon as you um you guys all of you guys asked me to do the interview I really loved your style like I love this um let's have a look I love this um like this coat like I just love the whole like you know you've got the big sleeves very oversized <laughs> Um, I think the silhouette is really quite interesting as well. So you've got, you know, the nice denim jeans, you know, and I love the boots as well. I think they're really cool. They're sharp, they're fierce, you know, you've got to have a bit of leather, the earrings, you know, the style from head to toe. I just absolutely love it. Like even you guys as well. I love all your styles, but yeah, I love it. Like literally. Thank you. Yes, thank yeah, you very really much. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. It's my pleasure. Thank yeah. you. Kudo <laughs> Chihuahua. Did I say it right? Thank you. Thank you.